Hello guys and welcome to new simplified mod tutorial for Minecraft 1.2.5 and today I'll be showing you guys exactly step by step simply how to install the single player commands mod for Minecraft 1.2.5 so the first thing you guys will need to do is you'll need to go to the link in the description which will lead you to Mediafire and the download for the single player command simplified and it also it has Optifine. I mean, if you guys don't want Optifine, I can put uh, two links in the description. So yeah, if you're saying, oh, I don't want Optifine for some reason, then I'll just you know put one without Optifine. <coughs> but yeah, I'm gonna be downloading Optifine one. So as you need to obviously just download it and wait for the download to finish, and then open it up. And, and close your web browser. You do not need it anymore. Or actually, don't quite, don't close your web browser because it means you're watching this video, and then it'll exit the video. So just minimize your web browser. <sighs> okay. So now you'll need to go to your Minecraft directory. So for Windows, you hit start. You click start, and type in percent app data. And for XP and Vista users, I believe you'd have to type in run, and then you type in percent of data, and you it'll lead you here. Okay, but so now once you're there, just click enter or just hit. or just why I keep saying hit or just click roaming. I'm just gonna click enter. Okay. So yeah, before I actually do this, guys, um, this could be very helpful too is making a shortcut for your dot minecraft so you don't always have to type in percent app data it's what i did for my desktop as you see right here the dot minecraft shortcut and it leads to the same exact thing so it is way easier i mean it, saves, it can save you some time but yeah to do that if you don't know how to create a shortcut is you know just right click and then create shortcut very simple and then you have a shortcut and drag it onto wherever you like but okay I'm going to delete that I was just showing you guys that to make your life easier <laughs> okay so open up your dot minecraft folder and then open up your bin folder and now this is kind of important like well if you have mods and stuff like that or anything on to your minecraft.jar then I'd recommend backing it up because you'll, you will be replacing you see right here these two jars will be going inside of this bin folder right here as this text file says um, but so yeah I'd recommend backing it up so all you need to do is to do that is just copy copy your minecraft.jar original and then paste it onto your desktop or wherever you like and then let's open up and back up to that okay so all you need to do now is delete your original minecraft.jar and then just drag these two two over on into the bin folder and then that's all you guys need to do <laughs> simple as that um, so yeah you can just close this and then you can close that and then open up your Minecraft and run it. Oh, and if you have any problems or anything like that, uh, I'll make a FAQ. Like I usually do on all my other mod tutorials. We see people sometimes have problems, and I don't like having to re answer stuff that I already answered, you know? So, you know, if you have any problems, then seriously just check down the description because I'll probably end up making an FAQ if there are any problems. <coughs> okay, so yeah, as you see, no black screen. Woo! And we didn't have to force update. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, I'm just going to go into single player and make a new world for the sake of this video. I'll name it MC Single Player Commands. There we go. Mod. Exclamation mark. I'll just put creative and I'll just make it super flat. And yeah, I'll just generate some structures. Okay, there we go. So I'm going to show you guys some of the basic commands. And this lets you know if it 
it, if it works it'll have that at the bottom right here single player commands 3.2.2 and then have that um, web address or wherever you can go to the following website okay you know what I am going to actually take off the fancy graphics and stuff like that because I want no lag at all at all okay and also I'm going to go into full screen <coughs> okay I just don't like having these right here wait hold up just a second okay so the basic commands are if you don't know them already is time so you can just type in like if you want daytime is time day and then it becomes day you see the sun just this, this came up time and night see now it's night time um I think also time morning is one on here I'm not too sure is it um no I don't think so I don't know okay and also I'm going to make it time day again and also weather is a good one too just type slash weather and whatever you want it to be but I believe if you just type slash weather then it will change to the wait what it'll change to the opposite of what it is like it should start raining right now okay well no I mean like you seen type like if you want to start raining type weather rain and then the rain will appear and come it get all dark and gloomy <laughs> and then let's say you don't want the rain anymore you type in the weather rain again ta da see the bright sun um so yeah those are the weather and time of the day's command um let's see what else oh yeah game mode of course you type in game mode and it'll put you into the opposite that you are not in so i'm in survival now just type in game mode and then it'll put me back into creative um let's see what else oh yes um one thing is you notice about this mod is that when you're typing something in it pauses which is kind of cool like pauses your game as if you were in just the pause menu um yeah also another command is kill all all it does is you know kills all the mobs around you and stuff but then they usually just spawn back so eh. but it can be kinda nice if you're building something and you don't want all the mobs everywhere then you just you know slash kill all of them um trying to think what else oh yeah if you if you want to see what all the commands are just type slash help as if you would on any other server you know you type slash help um so this is all the stuff you can do some pretty awesome stuff actually I think I'll make another video of me just you know screwing around with my favorite commands and all that um let me see okay there there is one to spawn mobs all you have to do is type in spawn I'll spawn like a creeper spawn three creepers so there we go see spawn three creepers ooh do damn creepers they make a big ass mess did you see you spawn a whole bunch of them um yeah just spawn in the mob name and then how much you want or if you just want there to be one then it'll just spawn one creeper if you don't put a number just spawn creeper 5000 no I'm just kidding I'd totally lag out the video if I did that it'd be stupid um so yeah this is just some of the basic commands and so yeah if you guys have any questions or anything like that I will put them in the description and I'll answer them so please don't comment like oh it's not working and stuff well then I'll you know you know I'll put it in the description <laughs> um, also I will put a link in the description
to what all the commands do and how to use world edit in the single player too so you guys can definitely check that out too um, if you need any extra help or wondering what all the other stuff does that's how I figured it out well I just knew world edit in general he's a London on the server I play on which if you guys didn't see my uh, other video of the MC server series it um, was a server I always play on and stuff it's called binary craft if you guys have not checked it out definitely check it out I will put the link in the description for the IP which is just binary craft dot dns dot org so yeah definitely check that out we recently became public we got a website and all that some sweet ass stuff too um yeah so guys if you like this video definitely like it slot me up a favorite maybe and subscribe if this is your first time watching any of my tutorials or anything like that yeah and i hope it helped see you guys later bye